All right, so today we'll be talking about the abdominal aorta, how to visualize your aorta, proximal, mid, and distal segment, your right and your left common iliacs, and also external and internal iliac arteries, okay? And also I'll be showing you some landmark where your celiac takes off, where your SMA takes off, and just those landmarks you should keep an eye on as you're scanning your abdominal aorta. For more reading, you can pick up my second edition. It's available now on Divine Scanning and on Amazon. On DivineScanning.com, you will have free shipping. However, on Amazon, of course, you have to pay for the shipping. So again, pick yourself up a copy and hopefully this would help you as an additional resource as you uh, continue in your journey as a sonographer. Thank you. All right, so we're looking at the aorta today. We'll be looking at the abdominal aorta. We're going to start from that proximal, and I'm just doing right now. I'm just doing a quick sweep down of the aorta and just adjusting my gains. All right, deep breath in and hold it for me, please. Deep breath in and hold it. There you go. She's taking it in a deep breath, and you can see that proximal aorta. You can see the proximal aorta right about there. That's your proximal aorta. I'm just going to start sweeping now. You can see the celiac. Um, take off with that breath. You can see the SMA begin taking off right there. You can breathe no more And that's your SMA and I'm just gonna follow that aorta all the way down to her belly uh, Belly button and you can see the aorta right there I'm gonna keep adjusting my gains because again when you're doing this aorta imaging you have to continuously Adjust your gain. You can see the bifurcation right about there. Now there's a trick to the bifurcation I like to use which is going below the belly button <coughs> Excuse me and just angling towards a head and you can see your right iliac coming right there. You can see the left common iliac also come in and you can see them become one um, as your distal aorta. So now I'm gonna go ahead again and do a sagittal aorta. Deep breath in again and hold it for me, please. She's on that deep breath. And I'm looking at that proximal aorta right there. That's the proximal aorta. It's a little shadowing coming off from the rib there, but I'm gonna keep following that down, proximal aorta. And you can see at some point here, the celiac is taken off right about there, right there. And then her SMA is right there. And I'm gonna just keep following that aorta in the sagittal segment down. She has a big bubble of gas right there. I'm gonna try to push past it, fix my gain a little bit so I can see a little better. All right, and then that's following that aorta down, fixing my gain as I come down again. Now the trick to the iliacs that I always use is, and this works for patients with different body habits as well, not just tiny patients or bigger patients, but all patients have seen this trick work, which is coming all the way to the right side. For example, I'm looking for a right iliac. So I'm gonna give it a push and I'm gonna to angle towards the midline, midline, midline. And guess what? I'm running right into that iliac. You can see it right there, common iliac artery, internal iliac artery, and external com uh, iliac artery right there. If I put color on it, you can actually really appreciate it. You see that coming in right there. That's a right common iliac splitting into the internal and the external. Now that same approach also applies for the uh, left side. Angle all the way out and just slowly come right into the midline there. And you should see it again, pop right at you right there. As I put the color on it, again, you can see the internal and your external right there, okay? Taking color off of it, you can see that common iliac artery there. Um, I'm just going to uh, give it a little bit of push. There you go. All right, so again, sagittal aorta. Deep breath again and hold it for me, please. At the proximal segment, following it down, I can see the celiac taking off right there. Let me get my little arrow on there. That's celiac right there, celiac. And then that's the SMA. And again, we're gonna just follow that down, follow that down, giving it a little push, 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 push. Push through the gas, turn up your gain. Um, and there you go, you can see that aorta begin to taper off, taper off. And then you can use this approach and that approach for the iliac vessel. Hopefully this help you in identifying um, your abdominal aorta. Right at the center of your belly, you cannot miss it. All right, thanks for watching.